Wiring relays is something in industrial electronics that seems like it should be really easy, but often leads to a lot of confusion because on most of these relays, there's so many terminals. Now, let me explain one really simple but extremely common function of a relay, and that is what we call a seal-in or a latching circuit. Now, in ladder diagrams, this would be considered a stop button that supplies electricity, and then after the stop button, the electricity goes through a start button to supply energy to a motor or to a relay coil. In addition to supplying electricity to the coil, we also can supply electricity to the contacts. And in this arrangement, if we press the start button, this seal-in or this latching branch causes it to remain on when we press the start button until we press the stop button, stopping the electricity. So let's test this circuit and see if it works the way it's supposed to for a seal-in circuit. I press my green start button and I hear a click and I see the indicator on the relay that says, sure enough, it's on. I press the red button and it turns off. Now, a common problem that we can run into, which is a very simple wiring mistake, is by misreading the terminals on the relay and instead of wiring the normally open set of the contacts on our relay, we accidentally connect the normally closed contacts of the relay. This is called short cycling and let's see what happens. Once I've supplied the electricity, I hear this buzzing noise. And the reason for this buzzing noise is that the electricity is immediately applied to the coil as soon as I turn on the supply. But as soon as the coil is energized, it opens up the circuit, which kills the electricity to the coil. But as soon as the electricity to the coil turns off, the normally closed contact engages again and resupplies energy to the relay's coil. So as fast as possible, that contact is switching open and closed and open and closed as fast as it can. For a large contactor, you'd hear the same thing, but a much slower repetition or a lower frequency of sound. Either way, if we've done some replacement of a re relay and we've done a little bit of rewiring, and as soon as we apply power, we hear that buzzing noise, nothing's wrong with the circuit components. It's just one miswire from a normally closed contact where it should have been a normally open and we hear that annoying buzzing sound.